Donald Trump got a lot of criticism after the violence broke out in Charlottesville, Virginia. And he originally said that, hey, there's violence on both sides. Later on, he finally released a statement 48 hours later condemning the white supremacist who carried out the acts of violence. However, now it seems like he's taking that statement back. In fact, he believes that there are members of the alt right that are wonderful people. Both sides, sir. You said there was hatred, there was violence on both sides. I do think there's blame. Yes, I think there's blame on both sides. You look at you look at both sides. I think there's blame on both sides, and I have no doubt about it. And you don't have any doubt about it either. And, and, and if you reported it accurately, you would say. They started this. They showed up in Charlottesville. They showed up in Charlottesville to protest. Excuse me. They didn't make themselves stand as you. And you had some very bad people in that group, but you also had people that were very fine people on both sides. You had people in that group. Excuse me. Excuse me. I saw the same pictures as you did. You had people in that group that were there to protest the taking down of, to them, a very, very important statue. And the renaming of a park from Robert E. Lee to another name. All right, uh, I, Anna, I'm, I have a thought on this too. Na 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 na. This guy is so fucking done. So you're telling me that you're going to tell the American people, those guys who showed up with Klan torches uh, to support a Confederate statue? If it was just a Confederate statue, yes, that's your portion of Trump's base who's like, yeah, Confederacy is awesome, Southern heritage, whatever, right? And they don't wanna complete the thought, and what, what was the Confederate heritage all about? I know, I know that that's a decent chunk of the American people. But then you had the guys with swastikas, you had the guys showing up with Klan outfits, you had the guys who were white nationalists, white supremacists. It was unite the right of all the loathsome things on the right. If, if, if that's Trump's version of the right wing, I'm telling you right now, there's a lot of right wingers in America who go, no, I didn't sign up for that. I'm not going to a Klan rally with torches. And he just put me in the same group. Is he saying that I'm part of that? No, 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 no. So look, I'm not as, <laughs> he's way worse to the right wing than I am, which is amazing. Because I actually think that there's a decent chunk of the right wing that doesn't believe in that at all. But he's, he thinks that's you guys, he thinks that that rally was uniting the right. That oh yeah, I mean you got the Klan and the Nazis, and you know you got the good guys like the white nationalists. Where the hell were the good guys on that side? Now this, no man, this guy's supporting Nazis. This is crazy. He's gone, man. This is not America. And I, if I'm wrong about that, and it turns out America is pre World War II Germany, well then we're all screwed. But I don't think so. I think we're a way, way better country than that. And even a majority of the right wingers who are gonna. At some point, raise their hand and go, I'm not part of the freaking clan, man. I don't know what this guy's talking about. Watch the Young Turks commercial free, download it or stream it, watch it any way you like at tytnetwork.com slash join.